This is Fort Boise Produce, located in Parma, Idaho, along the Oregon-Idaho border. Fort Boise packs onions for about 15 different growers who farm in eastern Oregon and western Idaho. During harvest, the onions are brought from the field to the facility where they load it up into bins. Each of these bins receives its own barcode tag, which represents what grower and what field those onions came from. These bins are then put into air temperature controlled storage facilities where they will be kept at a cool temperature curing down until they are ready to pack along the packing line. When the onions are brought to the facility to be packed, they are put onto this piece of equipment which dumps the bins onto the packing line. At this point, the tags that are on each bin will be scanned out of inventory. Only bins from the same grower and same field will be ran at one lot at a time. Now all subsequent product that is made from these onions will be allocated to the specific grower and field that those onions were grown at. The onions are then graded and sorted on the packing line. They are then put on a transition belt where they go to a pre-singulator. This pre-singulator puts each onion in front of the other and gets them ready to each go into their own cup on the sizer. The sizing equipment weighs each onion and also takes a picture so that the onions can be sorted by both color and by weight. The packing line software then tells those onions where they need to go. Here you can see we are putting 50 pounds of onions to each drop. Once that drop receives its 50 pounds, it will go on to the next drop. And then the, the person that is bagging that onion, that, that bag knows that he has gotten 50 pounds of onions in there. The onion bags are then stickered with a USDA positive lot identification code. This sticker allows the consumer to get online to traceproduce.com, type in the same code that the USDA uses for lot identification on the quality control inspection side, and see where those onions came from, the field and grower. 1% of everything that comes off of the conveyor belt has to be inspected. We have in-house inspectors that are certified by the state of Idaho and USDA grade standards. They inspect on computerized software that was approved by USDA. There's an inspection camera above the, the, the table here where this inspector can take a picture of that sample. This allows for objectivity on both sides if there are any quality complaints, complaints where both sides can look at the picture and see exactly what those onions look like during the inspection process. This software program allows for pictures and it allows for everything to be put online integrated with shipping and sales to see exactly how product that went on each order inspected. State inspectors audit the, the in-house inspector periodically throughout the day as this person on the right is. The onions are then put onto pallets. These onions will be wrapped and put on the floor prepared for loading. Along with the larger bags, small retail consumer bags receive this same traceback USDA code. Here we have a printer that prints that code as the lot gets made and the bags get the identification code put on their label. This printer has a laptop next to it and only people that are certified by the state can get on there and change the lot identification code. Once again, the consumer can get online and see where those onions came from. Finished product is then loaded onto trucks when the associated orders truck comes. Each pallet receives a barcode tag representing the number of bags that came from that farm and field. And as those onions go out on the sales order, they will be scanned out of inventory, which assigns those exact onions to that sales order. This allows for complete traceability because you can know exactly what quantity of bags went to what distribution center or drop location. This is how the Fort Boise produce operation runs.